Lalgudi Gopala Iyer Jayaraman the 17th of September 1930 to the 22nd of April 2013 was an Indian Carnatic violinist vocalist and composer He was awarded Padma Bhushan by the government of India in 2001 He is commonly grouped with MS Gopala Krishnan and TN Krishnan as part of the violin trinity of Carnatic music his disciples included his two children Lalgudi G. J. R. Krishnan, Lalgudi Vijayalakshmi, his sister Lalgudi Srimathi Brahmanandam, renowned musician S. P. R. A. M. H. grandson of Sri. G. N. Dandapani Iyer, renowned Harakatha exponent Vishaka Hari, Sekatharaman, Vital Ramamurthy, Dr. N. Shushidar, Padma Shankar, Kanchan Chandran, Raghuram Hosahali, Srinivasamurthy, Pakala Ramdas, Sankari Krishnan, Yamini Ramesh, Mumbai Shilpa, Shreya Devnath, Kritika Natarajan, Salem Sisters, Arushi Ramesh, the leading Vainika Srikanth Cherry and the Academy Award nominated Bombay Jayashri Ramnath. Early life and background Born in the lineage of a disciple of the saint musician Thyagaraja, Lalgudi Jayaraman inherited the essence of Carnatic music from his versatile father, V. R. Gopala Iyer, who trained him. Gopala Iyer, a martinet, enforced traits of intense focus and discipline in the young Jayaraman through rigorous lessons. Though a harsh father and guru, Gopala Iyer would not allow the young Jayaraman to even sharpen pencils, believing that his tender fingers were too precious. Career At the age of 12, he started his musical career as an accompanying violinist to Carnatic musicians before rising as a prominent soloist. He expanded the style of violin playing by inventing a whole new technique that is designed to best suit the needs of Indian classical music and establishing a unique style that came to be known as Lalgudi Bani. Jayaraman composed several kritis, talanas and varnams and dance compositions, which are a blend of raga, bhava, rhythm and lyrical beauty. Lalgudi's instrumental talent comes to the fore in the form of lyrical excellence. He brought the most sought-after vocal style into violin, and his renditions exhibit knowledge of lyrical content of the compositions. Lalgudi actively and scientifically learned to self-critique his performances and dutifully wrote detailed reviews after each concert, a habit encouraged by his father and guru. He was loath to experiment on stage in his solo concerts and almost always planned to the last detail, leading a certain critic to tout them as being intellectual rather than emotional in spirit, but Lalgudi's spontaneity and innate musical genius were often seen when he accompanied leading vocalists. He was always in great demand for accompanying vocalists, and has accompanied great vocal virtuosos as Arayakudi Ramanuja Iyengar, Kambai Vaidyanatha Bhagavatar, M. D. Ramanathan, Semangudi Srinivasa Iyer, G. N. Balasubramaniam, Madurai Mani Iyer, Valeti Venkataswarulu, Medinari Krishnamurti, K. V. Narayana Swami, Maharajapuram Santhanam, D. K. J. Raman, M. Balamurali Krishna, T. V. Sankaranarayanan, T. N. Seshagapalan and flute maestro N. Ramani. He was forbidden from accompanying female artistes by his father, a promise that he dutifully kept. He has given concerts extensively in India as well as abroad. The government of India sent him to Russia as a member of the Indian cultural delegation. His accompanying wizardry and quick responses to the various challenges posed by the main artistes remain unsurpassed. His accomplishments are numerous but chief of them is the fact that he was the first to bring international attention to the Carnatic style of violin playing. He also introduced a new concept of musical ensemble with violin, venue, flute and veena in 1966, and gave several outstanding concerts. After inviting him to play the Edinburgh Festival in 1965, Yehudi Menuhin, the renowned violinist, impressed by Lalgudi's technique and performance, presented him with his Italian violin. Lalgudi presented Menuhin with an ivory dancing Nataraja when Menuhin visited India. He has also performed in Singapore, Malaysia, Manila, and East European countries. His recordings submitted to the International Music Council, Baghdad, Asian Pacific Music Rostrum and Iraq Broadcasting Agency by Air New Delhi have been adjudged as the best and accorded the first position out of 77 entries received from the various countries during 1979. He was invited to give concerts at Cologne, Belgium and France. The Government of India chose him to represent India at the Festival of India in USA, London and he gave solo and Jagalbandi concerts in London and also in Germany and Italy that received rave reviews. 
Sri Lal Goody went on a tour in the year 1984 to Oman, UAE, Qatar and Bahrain, which was highly successful. He composed the lyrics and music for the operatic ballet Jaya Jaya Devi, which premiered in 1994 at Cleveland, Ohio US, and was staged in many other cities in the United States. In October 1999, Lal Goody performed in the UK under the auspices of Sruti Laya Sangam Institute of Fine Arts. After the concert, a dance drama Pancheswaram, composed by Lal Goody, was staged. His biography, An Incurable Romantic, by Lakshmi Devnath, was released posthumously in 2013. It contains a foreword by Siddharist Ravi Shankar, and charts his 70 years in the music industry. <laughs> <laughs> Awards Jayaraman earned several titles, such as Nada Vidya Talaka by Music Lovers Association of Lal Goody in 1963, Padma Shri by the Government of India in 1972, Nada Vidya Rathnakara by East West Exchange in New York, Vadya Sangeetha Kalaratna by Bharati Society, New York, Sangeetha Chudamani by Sri Krishna Gana Sabha, Chennai in 1971, State Vidwan of Tamil Nadu by the Government of Tamil Nadu and Sangeetha Natak Academy Award in 1979 etc. The first Chaudhaya Memorial National Level Award was given to Sri Jayaraman by the Chief Minister of Karnataka. He also received honorary citizenship of Maryland, U.S. in 1994 and the Padma Bhushan by the Government of India in 2001. He won the National Film Award for Best Music Direction for the film Shringaram in 2006. In 2010, Jayaraman became a Fellow of the Sangeet Natak Akademi. Personal life Lalgudi Jayaraman was married to SMT Rajalakshmi and had two children, his son GJR Krishnan and his daughter Lalgudi Vijayalakshmi. Both follow the footsteps of their father and are famous in their own right. He had three sisters Padmavathi, Avinika, Rajalakshmi and Srimathi, both violinists. Srimathi learned violin from him as well. The renowned Veena player Jayanti Kumaresh is SMT Rajalakshmi's daughter. Jayaraman died on the 22nd of April 2013 after suffering a cardiac arrest at his home in Chennai. He is survived by his son and daughter. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Compositions. Most famous for his Thalanas and Varnams, Sri Lalgudi Jayaraman is considered one of the most prolific composers of modern times. His compositions span four languages Tamil, Telugu, Kannada and Sanskrit, as well as a whole range of ragas not conventionally used for Varnams or Thalanas. Characteristic of his style, the melody of his compositions camouflages subtle rhythmic intricacies. His compositions are very popular with Bharathanatyam dancers, even as they have become a standard highlight of every leading Carnatic musician's repertoire. His compositions include Varnams Pada Varnams Topic Thalanas. Sri Lalgudi Jayaraman also tuned the Swati Tirunal Thalana in Raga Dhanashri and set the compositions in its current form, which then went on to become hugely popular. Topic Krithis. Apart from these compositions, Sri Lalgudi Jayaraman has composed Jathaswarams and Swarajathas as well. The Jathaswaram in Rasakapriya Raga is popular among Bharatanatyam dancers. He has also composed a unique Swarajathi which demonstrates the concept of grabheadam, using ragas Sindhu Bhairavi, Chenkyoruti, Mahanakalyani, Bahag and Tilling. He was a much sought after tunesmith who set tunes to numerous songs and compositions including several Krithis of Ambujam Krishna. <laughs> 